私は名もなきファラオ神戸を垂れなさい不敬であるぞこら中を覗いてはいけない。出ません出ませんそれさおいでません不敬に罰は悪逆に死神々に軽んじるのファラオを愚弄するのお前たちの罪はここで注がれる沈め沈め沈め沈めスネフェルギオテルナイルそーれジャパン Hello everyone Welcome back for some more. Let's play Fate Grand Order. We completed the memorial quests, uh, which I had my friends confirm that the quest that I used the revive on was just as garbage as I thought. And it's fine. It's fine. We also did go to the virtual world. So go watch that video if you haven't. It was wild. Uh, this time, we're just back with some more interludes because we got those. Yeah, we got all these to deal with. We've done those. And uh, I used my second ticket, right? I'm pretty sure I did. I actually don't. Yeah. Ex oh, exchange has ended. I already, already done my two. So let's do some more interludes because, again, we got to clean these out and this is the time. Uh, let's again, I want to go through the maps first, just because of the fact that I want my number down badly. Little bit of London. Oh, people didn't miss that accent. Alright, let me get the, uh, the dates to see when these are out. I assume all of these are coming at a later date now, but start off with London. Uh, we, oh, we gotta send you, huh? I'll work on that after. Uh, for now... Let's see here. We can start off at, uh, let's see, who do we got? We'll start off here. People have said this one is a good one, so this one came, this was a release one? This was a release one, I guess. Really? But wasn't, wasn't London added later? Huh? Okay, guess this is a release one. Devil's Quest. Isn't that a Capcom game? No, that's Demon. No, that's, um. D D Demon's Crest, right? Oh, we have to use you as a servant. Okay, interesting. Let's go with Kill Assassin. Which is not the team that should be here at all. Y'all aren't killing assassins as assassins. Let's go with. Uh, the, the, the goody goods. Let's go with all these powerful casters. Because, man, what a class. What a class. And, in fact, you know what? Just for hits and shiggles, let's pop on to make it so that we can just pretty much instantly do shenanigans. Right? You two there. You got that there. Um, we can then pop in. Uh, let's go with... Mr. Splody Man. Right, and then we can get a four star in here as well. Let's go with. Um. Gil. Okay, so then with you, we want the one that gives the death chance up. Let's see here. Death success up. That's pretty much the only one. It's only 10%, but hey, it works. Uh, sure. Actually, no, let's let's get that switch to you. Because you can get meter pretty quickly here. Uh, let's just go with um, some gain. Starting gain there. Uh, sure. Well, strength doesn't matter with you, because yours isn't a thing there. It doesn't do damage. Let's go... There we go. And then that should be, I mean, aside from this, let's just go. We don't need quick with you. Sure. All right. Sure. Here we go. Let's just rip on through these dudes. And to make our life easier also, let's even put on uh, the, well, actually probably the better one 
would be, well, I I was gonna say we can absorb it, but I don't know how, well, even if, even if yours takes too long, we can instead pop yours, so, okay. Let's do this. Look at me planning. Planning my stuff. Foe yesterday, ally today, huh? That's, that's the fate. Feels so bizarre, you know? He was one of the masterminds behind Project Demonic Fog. But now he's one of our allies. A miracle of the heroic spirit summoning system, I suppose. But I admit I was startled when he said that he wanted to go to the London of that era. That's understandable. I attempted to commit vile crimes against the world and its people. It's logical for you to doubt me. However, I truly do not wish for the human world to be destroyed. Thus, I sympathize with your goals and objectives. Now, I believe that it's possible to save all of my beloved children. My former self running that project may have laughed in contempt at such notion. But now, now that I've entered into a contract with Tanner, I have faith once again in people in the world. In the existence of allies of justice capable of fighting evil. Allies of justice? That is none other than all of you. You defeated me as I reached out to the project at the edge of despair. Allow me to say the following with the deepest gratitude. Thank you. I beg you to show me your power once more. Depends on the situation, Mr. Paracelsus. You mentioned unusual changes occurring in London as it corrects itself. That is what you claim? Yes. What do you mean by unusual changes? The demonic fog is gradually dissipating. As the air is corrected, London should return to normal without having to wait for the demonic fog to clear up. And yet, you seem to be agitated. Why is that? Maybe he senses something? To Master's query, all I can say is this. Yes and no. Well, that doesn't answer at all. It's true that I sense some kind of connection, but I also know that there's something in this place. Namely... Never mind. Let us speak later. Something remaining in the demonic fog approaches. He's right. Multiple magical energy readings detected in the fog. They're likely the automatas. They're bursting with magical energy, so be careful. Understood. Senpai, give us orders. Destroy the enemy while maintaining a barrier. It's like Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles for the Nintendo GameCube. And I guess now modern systems, but it's, it's not as cool when you select the levels from a menu and it's not like a... Not like a quest. Oh, apparently they might be streaming the um, Grand Order stuff at Anime Expo right now. Interesting. Interesting. I'm not going to kill these guys just because there's so few of them. Or I'm not, not going to, um, yeah, just insta-nuke them. Just kill these guys normally first. Then we'll do it when there's three. It's a better use of my time. All right, let's go kill. Do your stuff. You know, I've I've been watching a few friends at Anime Expo, and I gotta say, I don't want to be there. I wouldn't want to be there. It's way too much. Just too many people. Too many lines. I can't handle that. Like I've 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 been to London, I've been to Tokyo, but none of those they they all pale in comparison to what I've seen from Lion Con. It's rough. All right, so let's kill these guys first. Let's see how good our chance is of this. I guess I could have loaded it first, right? I could have loaded her, her her Noble Phantasm, and then the countdown would have been better now. Oh, yeah, I see, I see. Okay. Okay. Uh, yeah, because it's seven there. Right? So, too much for, for getting that. Um, let's go. That's fine. Let's just go. One, two, three. Let's try and get as much as we can with her. And we'll see if we can pop it again. I see. I'm starting to get some of the strategies about, like, when, like, you don't want to use their... If they have a battery type one, you want to use it right away so it starts charging right away. Yeah, yeah. 
That said, like, dang, she actually still has good game just in general. Okay. So let's, tr again, try and get as much as we can with her. Just to get some more. If that, if that hits for some good damage, we might get another here. We'll see. No stuns. It's a bit annoying. Well, it's hard to stun something that already shouldn't be moving, right? Okay, hit her. Hit her, hit her. You fools! That's what you get. We could probably do death up, right? No, three turns. Never mind. That's fine. We'll go one, two, three. Let's see here. Now, we don't have the death up on our skill, so let's see how good the chances are with just this. Okay. That was pretty good, though, because that's still one. Nice. Okay. Okay, okay. I see. I see. Good stuff. Okay. So. Uh, yeah, we're going to need a different group this time. Well, we got to use you. And otherwise, we got... Okay, so let's switch y'all out with, we need some sabers. We need, um, let's get two sabers. And let's also then get a rider. That obviously needs to change. Um, let's just give you, I don't know. Needs to be... Because I don't think we can afford a 5, right? No, we can exactly afford it. Nice. Uh, in that case... Sure. Sure, 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 sure. That works. Okay, that should be good, honestly. It's early. Don't need to worry about stuff. Apparently they announced Emya Gohan's English release on Anime Expo last time. They also said we might expect a Mahoyo announcement here. Ooh. I just got my art for Mahoyo. It's real good. And in combat, all enemies destroyed. Very impressive, Master. Let us be off then. I must show you firsthand what I know. There's an underground space under the southern tip of Regent's Park. It's part of the underground facility for the Mage Association, or rather, for the Clock Tower. You could say it's one of their quarantine areas. Oh, this is interesting. There's something here that has been sealed. Something? Stuff like dangerous magical tomes, mystic codes, and catalysts? Yes. Magical tomes. This is basically what I'm referring to. In particular, there's one tome that was used to seal a powerful evil that almost manifested itself in this world. That tome, along with many other magical books, was carefully sealed with powerful spells. Even the spread of the demonic fog could not weaken the seals placed on the tomes, just like other dangerous things that were sealed. However, you believe that these seals have been broken, correct? Yes. You seem quite certain about this. Yes, Senpai, I'm also bothered by his self-assurance. It's simple. The reason is that if I existed in this London and continued to pursue my designs, I would break the seals without fail. What? Huh? I mean, you're going to break the seals now? Foo! No, I'm not the one who will break the seals. It will be the one still here. To be more precise, the me from here. The voice, wait, I have to take a new servant. Show yourself. Loather and mourner of evil and yet is evil himself. You who would crush all life with the very hands that hold your dear children. You abomination. I am thou. Thou art I. Thy name is my name. Paracelsus von Hohenheim. Hohenheim. The consort of... That was straight from Persona. Come on, you can't do that. It's literally Persona. Come on. Oh dear, what an unfriendly way to address yourself. Huh. Which one is the real one? Maybe it's the one without the dark aura. How easy it is to confuse you. But I shall speak only the truth. We are both real. I am thou, thou art I. 
the servant Paracelsus beside you, you, beside you whom you duly summoned and made a contract with, an eye born of servant Paracelsus' magical energy that returned to the fog when you defeated him. Both share the name von Hohenheim. Hohenheim. That's fun to say. Both are real. Admittedly, my existence is somewhat unstable, for the Holy Grail is already gone, materialization while lacking ways to summon heroic spirits. He seems to be right. Observational data shows that his magical energy is weak. Demonic Fog has given birth to a final heroic spirit? Yes, exactly. That's why I'm in a hurry. In a hurry to destroy this era. At this rate, this era will be completely restored. If so, I cannot destroy it with my own hands. My existence will likely disappear. However, I can't let that happen. I have accepted the destruction of humanity as fate. Yeah, that's, that's the franchise. One cannot stop it, thus. I have no choice but to go through with this. What's here? What? Massive magical energy response. There's something behind him. It seems the seal's been broken. It seems my other self is quite efficient. How do you repair the seal? We must make haste. We must destroy it before it fully activates. If what was sealed materializes, the sixth imaginary factor... No. We must destroy it. Along oh, it's a demon. Okay. Along with my other self barring the way. Senpai? Let's do this, Mash. Yes, Master. Preparing for and entering battle immediately. Some you can tell it's pretty early because some of the lines are just... Just slightly awkward. Just ever so slightly awkward. But it is what it is. It's very clear that as time went on, they established more of a... Like a localization style guideline almost, right? Kind of how it feels. So let's start with this. Get as much as we can with you for meter and stars and all that. Ba -ba 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 -bow. Okay, and ooh, okay, this ain't bad at all. I'm not gonna pop their thing on just yet. Nice, nice, good stuff. You'll love to see it. All right, are we gonna have Shadow Paracelsus and a demon? Yep, that's exactly what I thought. Cool. Okay, well, um. Hmm, okay. And how much do you get? Not enough, but that's fine. Um, let's pop this on and let's say to not attack you. Okay, and let's go one, two, three. You'll definitely get more than enough meter. Alright, rapid casting. He hit the Dioscuri. Well, no, they're going to get it anyways. No, they, they didn't. Um, okay, so, pop this. Because they don't have one that gives them meter, right? No. Uh, let's go attack up with everyone. Let's go, you know what? Um, this gives... Nope, don't need that. That's all defense. So let's just go one, two, three. Sure. All right. Trample him. If I had a dollar for every time fate has been said this part, I'd have a couple bucks, which is a lot for, you know, fate. Fate doesn't normally bring up fate. It honestly feels like a title that they sometimes forget about. Every now and then they'll remind you, but for the most part it's like it's barely a thing. Alright, let's do this. This'll finish her off. The demon has been shevered. And Paracelsus has been Put it down. Sus. Nice. Good. Alright. So 
a nice little wrap up. Large type enemy destroyed. What a powerful enemy, but somehow we managed to... Why were we up on the surface? Do we not have the catacombs battle background at this point? How disappointing. That is all I can say to you after giving up. For the world will be incinerated. Ha, you thought. No, you are wrong. That is what I can say as I will not give up. I know the world will be saved. <laughs> How absurd. To think that I, the one who continued to choose evil despite having no desire to, would be punished. By my own hand. Ah, the end of this pathetic, ugly self. This I offer to you, Messiah. Is that... Is that the master from the prototype book that I haven't read? Well, prototype book and, um... Freaking, what are they called? Audio dramas. And me servant has gone completely silent, ending combat. Woo! -hoo. What a terrifying opponent to face. Well, we are in the heart of the Mage Association's lair. It was as fearsome as Fafnir. It really wasn't, but okay. It's a matter of luck that we pulled through. That's not true. You are all capable of victory. Even if it were to awaken once again. What? You are a bulwark against evil. You are truly the allies of justice that I believe in. Thus, no matter what fearsome opponents you may face... No matter what betrayals you face, no matter the depths of despair you witness, it is impossible for you to lose. Thanks, buddy. Now bless me with good rolls in the future. That's all I need you to do. Just a better increase damage to enemies. What a weird saying. Deal increased damage to all enemies. Oh no, that's a buff. Right. Right. It's not an attack. Uh, he once made a wish upon the Grail to reach the root. To be more specific, he wanted to prove his theory that the light of the planet, like the one that shines from a certain sacred sword, is indeed... Whoa! Oh, that's lore! Oh, what? Okay, well, that must be, again, prototype. But he wanted to prove his theory that the light of the planet, which is the one that shines from a sacred sword, interesting is the light that shines directly from the root. Oh, goodness. That's new. Are you saying... Oh, wow. Are you saying that... Okay, okay, okay. This is... This is, this is incredible. That Excalibur fires a shot from the root? That explains... A lot, actually. Oh, that's actually big lore for all of fate and all the Nasu verse, indeed. Okay, a bunch of books, a crowd of us. Let's see here. Nursery rhymes. Is that also a? That is also another release interlude. This is a long one. Okay. Well, we got to use her. Uh, so we can go back with this team. Sounds good. A bunch of books, a crowd of us. It's dark, isn't it? <laughs> it's very similar to a place we've seen before. The Soho area of London. I've been there, actually. I went to an arcade there. Where Anderson was, right? Yes, Senpai. It's very similar to the second floor of that bookstore. I'm sure it is. That's because your current location is inside Nursery Rhymes Reality Marble. Although slightly different if we were to be technical, it's a subtype of the dream shared by Master and the Contracted Servants. Anyway, it's a special place. A special place involving the servant Nursery Rhyme. Understood, Doctor. I came up with a similar theory. Because she's here. She's back to being a book. Yes, when you performed the second ascension, she gave the form of a young girl. So why has she regressed to her original form? She doesn't speak either. This is... <laughs> oh, I'm detecting magical energy in your vicinity. It looks like her, but it's not. They're trying to surround you, which means they're probably enemies. Oh, let's beat up some kiddos. Roger, Master, give me your orders. I want to put them down. These kiddos, these children. It's always so funny how it's like, I gotta say, 
Western games are like, no, we cannot harm a child. That's not allowed. Go play Japanese games and they're like, there's a six-year-old in this... Oh, no, they're just books. Oh, darn it. I was hoping they'd all be little ones of her. But you, you'll go and play, like, you know, a variety of games from Japan, and they'll be like, literally put down this child. Like, like, Melty Blood. You get to literally just, like, absolutely beat up. Like, what, a ten-year-old? It's great! They have, they have no qualms. They will do whatever. And yet in the West, it's like, no, you can't. You have to be nice to them. Children of the future. Debuff resist down. That's fine. As long as we don't get the one that gives guts, because that one is not nice. I'm not a fan. Uh, let's go one. Okay, so here's my plan. is I'm just going to get Nidocris just up in meter over and over. And that way I can, but I'm going to save the death up to laughter, right? Is that big brain? I think that's big brain. Save the death up for a bit. There we go. So now let's pop this. And if anyone survives, then hopefully she can do some damage as well, but I think they'll die from damage anyways. Okay. Good, we can get more meter back. Nice. Nice. Okay, that works. See? It's all corn kakaku! Kakakakaku! And let's go one, two, three. Alright. Boy! I'm real ex like I'm already planning like because the store right now is full of um the 50 like gold level up materials that you can get uh every month so like I'm fully planning to get Castori at a level 100 like right away just immediately uh let's see here Get you up a bit more. Yes, and you just need a little bit there. Uh, but yeah, getting her right up right away. So, I mean, you mean, like, my, my inventory is full right now. And my second uh, archive is full right now of level up stuff. I mean, I have enough that I can play missions here and there. But, like, that's the plan. Is to just completely, completely you know, do that to, to get her all the way up there. Because if she's as good as people say, which, again, I looked at her skills and stuff, and it seems to be, and this is the meta going forward, uh, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Nice. Good. And then a little bit more. And you're stunned. That's all good. Interesting that one death came up with overcharge and the other one didn't. It's real curious. Just because it's like, I would have thought it would have just been the same regardless, but I guess not. Look at them. I love their weird noises too. Dang. That was some surprisingly good um, meter gain too. All right. Well, hey, we don't even need to pop it right now. We can pop it next turn. Okay, but we'll pop this. And let's go... Alright, let's go... One, two, three... Because if they don't kill, then we'll do it, and do it again. It's me playing with, like, insta-death for pretty much the first time. Not something I play around with much, so... Let's see. Nice. Not bad, not bad. Obviously, it only works on the fact that we're fighting trash mobs. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff.
Okay. Hey, guess what? Kill Caster. Okay. Again, this team ain't, uh, ain't ain't perfect. In fact, it ain't that great. So we're gonna get you in there. We're gonna get you. You can just go to the back. Um, let's actually just to make our life easier, let's switch you off with uh with you there. Okay. Oakley Dokley, let's go. Enemies defeated. She helped us. Which means that, yep, her Ceram accepts Tanner as her master. She's a book, so she doesn't talk, though. What is happening, exactly? Looking into it, Doctor. Or keep looking into it, Doctor. It appears we've got more enemies approaching. Senpai, give me your orders. The battle continues. Okay. That was... That was not much story. We'll see here. Just more books? Is that just what we're doing? Just more books? Oh, just more books. Okay. Fine by me. All right. So let's just start with some of this. It is funny just because of her charge there. Like, she always starts with pretty much 60% when with her uh, stuff on. It's pretty good. Because, yeah, one combo and she's got it, right? Like, not bad at all. Ooh, oh, Protea's oh. kind of rocking, honestly. Very happy I got her up to level 100. And when she gets that next buff, hot dang. That's going to be really good. Also, dang, okay. Okay, calm down, guys. We're going to destroy this wave. Sayo the Nara. You're, like, gonna get epically owned. Just put that on, because I forgot that that doesn't buff him. I'm not even gonna lie. I'm not even gonna lie. Doesn't matter. One, two, three. We win. Boom, bam. Easy peasy. Alright, how much we have left on them. Okay. Ah, oh, well, actually, the Grimoire, the, the gold one might survive this. We'll see. We're pretty buffed, but we're not that powerful. Ooh, those are some good numbers, but not enough. Yeah, just under. Oh, well. Okay. So let's just go one, two, three. There we go. Slam jam, one HP. Rider kick, bless up. God, I'm excited for him to get his masked up costume, though. Looks so cool. Protea Phyto, indeed. Apparently, uh, CCC Foxtail is really good. And I do want to read it. But, you know, just waiting for... Waiting for the ability to. Okay, well, that worked well. The only thing I'd say is let's switch out um, to the this. Because if we can pop that, then we can get way more meter by reducing waivers there, right? If we need it, at least. I doubt we will. Woo! Battle is over. We've defeated them. Good work, senpai. I'm not getting anywhere with my analysis, but I have news. There's something very similar to Nursery Rhyme nearby. That army of books was similar to her, but this is more like an exact copy. Oh, we're doing Persona again. This might be what pulled you into that space. Can you try talking to it? Nothing else to do anyway. Okay, senpai, let's move. You too, Nursery Rhyme. Book. Oh, when you move, she follows you, huh? She's like a mystic code. That book's really attached. That's really rather nice. Yeah, it feels like watching a cute little animal. Is that... Seems like it's up ahead. I can feel the response. Whew. Here it comes. Looks like it's approaching. Might be an enemy, so be careful. Hello, the other me. I missed you, book me. Emotions folded in between the pages. I missed you, real me. The one who can do nothing without fingers to flip the pages. I am me, Alice. You are me, a story. I was going to say, I wonder if this is going to be Alice. 
No, no, I am me. I'm not Alice. You stay in that form, okay? Alice? What's going on? I don't know exactly. But the one that's connected to you by contract is the one that's a book. But at the same time, the girl over there... She doesn't seem to be a fake nursery rhyme. Her magical energy feels too similar. I got a detailed analysis now that you're closer. Yep, Ash is right. Their magical energy response is identical. It's too identical, like another copy of the same being. I want to say that's impossible, but where you are in a way is inside nursery rhyme. It's possible that her core is split into two beings. Dumb it down for me. Uh, in English, Einstein. <laughs> I hate that line so much. They're both her. It's a possibility. Correct. It talked. Phew. That's me. The other me. The me in Alice's form. The Alice that shouldn't exist. Because I imitated that form. I thought to myself, that form is Alice's, but... Is it okay for me to take it? Can I be Alice when there is no Alice here? No, 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 it's wrong. I'm just a story, right? Alice isn't here, only I'm here. I must stay a story. I can't stay as Alice, right? She's like conflicted over this? I see, so that's it. Nursery Rhyme isn't supposed to have a human form. But the Ascension gave her the form of a little girl. That self-contradiction grew within her. So she called Tanner, her master deep inside. She's trying to get an answer, isn't she, about which form she should choose. The book nursery rhyme is uncertain. The girl nursery rhyme wants to reject it. I mean, it's her choice. That's right, senpai. Nursery rhyme, the answer's within you. We can't answer for you. We don't know what that girl's form means to you. We don't know why you're hesitating or who or what you're thinking of. So, I am me, I know that. But I want to be Alice. I want that form if I can have it. I want to drink sweet, sweet tea as Alice. I want to eat sweet, sweet candy as Alice. I want to play as Alice. That was all Alice longed to do when she held me in her arms until the very end. Senpai, well, there's your answer. Right, Master. I see, so that was my decision, but I won't allow it. I am me. Alice isn't here. I won't let you pretend this is a happy ending. Magical new response expanding. Here she comes. Okay, so yeah, I mean, this... I always thought it was a bit weird that she was still in the form of Alice when Alice isn't in this universe, but I guess such a memory stuck with her spirit, you know, spirit origin or spirit core there. And now that's just what she kind of wants, you know, it goes across universes and stuff. Machen mein Lieben? Okay, interesting. Well... Let's do this thing. Let's pop this. Is this going to be enough to get you full meter? I think it is. Nice. Sick, sick. Let's do this. Let's, let's just go. And now that we pop that, let's immediately pop this on you to get that cooldown even better, right? Yeah, cool. All right. Well, let's just go. I mean, we're not going to get the big bonus for the, um, for being big, but that's fine. The big bonus. See, it works out. We'll still do good damage here. Alright. And yeah, that didn't do a ton, but that's fine. That did a lot. Alright. Nice. You love to see it. Um, let's go... One, two, three. Nice! Okay, okay. Well, that's... That's almost that, then. Let's go one... Let's eat just kill you here or come close that's gonna kill all right boy you sure are debuffing us with debuffs over and over 
Well, let's finish this. Here we go. Okay. Look at that. Look at that. 100 again. What a wild dude. We're almost at 100. That's a good number. Enemy unit defeated. Huh. Actually, I knew this was how it was going to end. If Alice isn't here, I can just become Alice. That's the kind of dumb idea I'd get now. Listen to me, if you're going to choose Alice's form, never let your story have an unhappy ending. Weird lack of sound effects. Very strange. Very strange. Yeah. I'll make it a happy ending. I'll do my best for Alice. Foo! Yeah, where's the sound effects? It's just all gone! Okay, I think we're done. The weird space is closing. There's no sound effects even. I think so, yeah. I'll use the ratio of technology to get you back to Kaldia. Ready? Go! There it is. They forgot to write in the, the, the script, and I don't mean the, the writing script, but the programming script to add the sound effects there. Level Phantasm rank up. Uh, just more damage to all enemies. Sure. Oh, we didn't do this. Uh, uh, oh, my, oh dear, my little Tom Thumb, you worked so hard to get here, but your adventure's on end. It's almost time to sleep. The curtain falls. Are these all just going to be nursery rhymes? Uh, morph, I'm going to transform. Yes, I'm going to transform. I am you and you are me. I'm going to transform. Yep, I'm transform. Now I'm you and you are me. Acroid and celluloid. Acrostic and sadistic. What a frick. Everyone here is just a thing. Birds are birds and people are people. And what's wrong with that? Your name is mine. Ooh, this weird. Story lasts forever, like thin fingers going back to, uh, to the first page or reaching for the second volume as long as a sad reader refuses to accept reality. Nursery rhyme is not a hero, but a general term for a genre of picture books. This genre has been uh, loved in Europe, and after being the home from so many children's dreams, began to exist as a concept, which became a servant that is the hero of children. Uh, they later would form the foundation of the work of the famous author Lewis Carroll. Yep, so very clearly based on... Alice in Wonderland, which, of course, yep, yep, yep. Okay, um, that looks pretty long. Go with a short one. Just sounds good. Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. Man, we're getting a bunch of prototypes. Oh, interesting. You start with Hyde. That's kind of cool, actually. Okay, neat. Since I'm never going to use him otherwise, let's bring him up here, right? Sure. Just just for hits and shiggles, let's do it. Like, when, am, when else am I going to use this guy? Sure. I'm feeling pretty good. I finally took control of Hyde at last. It's all thanks to you, I should say. You got a little... You got a little ragu on your stomach, my good sir. Let me say thank you from my heart. I might finally be liberated from my own karma. Well, I don't know. You don't look like you're about to be liberated. Foo! Yeah, that bloodstain worries me, buddy. Uh, yeah, let's see. Senpai, when he says he might be liberated, it might mean a liberation reaffirming violence. Don't you feel it can be taken that way? Actually, sorry, with a capital S, I had you bring me all the way to London, the fourth singularity. I'm grateful to you guys. Ascension? Was it? It was truly amazing. I'm impressed that it could turn me, nothing more than a failed mage, into such a powerful servant. Besides, as you can see, I got a chance to come to London, though the demonic fog still remains. Since the Holy Grail was removed, London is undergoing correction to its current era. But what brought you here? You just wanted to visit your homeland, is that it? Huh? Uh, sure, something like that. Mash, you are quite perceptive. Yes, I wanted to see my homeland firsthand. I'm glad you understand me. You're lovely, Mash Curia Light. A love confession? No, I don't think so. He seems... Oh, I love you, London. Of course I love you, Sky. Gas lamp. I love you very much. As you see, his love spreads very wide. 
But it is exactly as we predicted beforehand. Well, I'm sorry for interrupting when you are hyped up, but, uh, there's a bit of demonic fog left. You guys might hinder the phenomenon called the correction of the air by being there. Yeah, who knows what might happen. Isn't it time for us to go back? Can I prepare the ray shift? I'm sorry, but will you wait just a little? There's a place I want to visit. You guys saw me once before, right? In this era, this foggy city seeking the fourth holy grail. You mean, we saw you in your lifetime? Yes, you did help us a lot. Do you remember about when you saved London with us? Sure, mostly. Anyway, you know, I want to see for myself this apartment where I supposedly lived. If possible, I wish to talk to myself in my lifetime too. I get it, but you should know that Mr. Jekyll may no longer be there. This error is being corrected. He may already have returned to the time he's supposed to live in. Even if so, I still wish to visit. May I? If you could see him, would there be anything you should do? Oh, you're you're in a persona also? We need three for three? Yes, I have something to tell him. But no matter what happens in the future, he can definitely overcome it. <laughs> except, <laughs> except for the whole, you know, deeply unbalanced servant sort of thing. At least I overcame Hyde by killing myself, so I hope that I can just give my past self a piece of advice. It can even be something short, like be brave and face yourself. I know it's merely self-satisfaction. Whatever I say will probably be erased in the correction of the era. And yet, I wish to tell him. Well, if that's the case, is it okay? Is something like this okay? Uh, of course, it won't cause something like a time paradox, but hmm. There's a lot of weird wrong capitalization in this one. Hmm. Foo! So, you came to me? I understand most of the situation. At any rate, it's great to see you guys again like this. Oh, you seem rather different. You think? Me too, it's good to see you again, Mr. Henry Jekyll. I'm glad to know you're doing great. And, well, whom I see over there is my... Your future self. Just think that for now. Okay. Jacket up. Uh Okay, so it's jacket open with the blood stains. Okay, that's kind of that's pretty much it, huh? I thought so. Why is that in quotation marks? I take it you understand the basic gist at a glance. In that case, I suppose you also know what I'm trying to do, Mr. Henry Jekyll. Surely. <laughs> then can you die for me? Uh Foo! What? What's going on there? He just jumped on Mr. Jekyll, didn't he? He did, Doctor. He tried to murder himself from his lifetime. This is wild. <laughs> That's right, I wish. Wow, just no transition, just... No, you listen to me. I want to kill me or Jekyll, who's lived his goody-goody life from the day he was born. Honestly, trust Goodwill. I don't need that kind of crap. You hear me? I can't stand the fact that you exist. I will kill you, and I will be the complete hide. I'm positive he's an anti-hero. Wait, he is, right? Any, anyway, we must stop him. Well, it's okay. I've always wanted to fight seriously with him once. Mr. Jekyll? You want to kill yourself? I'm not losing my mind, and I'm not a powerless human failure of a mage either. I am a heroic spirit. I'm one of the lost servants materialized from the remains of the demonic fog. I was summoned after you returned to Caldia, and the living Jekyll returned to this his era. That's the story. What? Why are you crying? I somehow had a feeling that a thing like this could happen. So I was waiting, right in this room, right after my living self returned to the original era. Two identical heroic spirits are in the same place? Could this really happen? Wait a sec, I see. Maybe his spirit has... has completely separated personalities. Why? This writing is so weird. Damn, damn, damn! Shoot, I did all this for nothing! Finally, I thought I could finally kill Jekyll! You should read Wells, though his books were published after we died. The rank system of heroic spirits may be something that transcends such a notion, but it's fine. Tanner, Mash, can you fight with him against me? What do you mean? If he's like that, he could be dangerous to get along it, as your ally, right? So I think I should make him learn his lesson now for the future. It makes sense. N Doctor d doesn't... Fine, fine, you bastard of... Be happy to play your game you by myself. God damn it, I'm gonna take all this penta banger out on you. Senpai, what are we gonna do now? Well, whatever happens, happens. Uh -oh. 
Yes, Master. Servant battle commencing. It's a bit weird, isn't it? Because we're in London, Senpai. Seems a little strange. Wow, someone just uploaded Canis in a suit to our Discord. God, Canis looks good in a suit. Okay, well. Yeah, because how often do you have, like... And I, 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 they need to rework him. He's so bad. I mean, cool. Increased stun success rate is high and low chance to inflict enemy. Cool, right? It worked. But still, bro. I mean, yeah, his stuff gets better when he's in that. But it's still not great. It's actually pretty bad. Okay, well, right, let's just go one, two, three. It's like the only time I'll ever use hide, so. And he's going to die right away, too. Double crit up. I mean, he doesn't have many stars, so it doesn't super matter, but... Okay, let's go. One, two, three. Okay. Get big. Like, just compare how good King Protea is to, to Jekyll and Hyde, right? Like, it's like these, these are two characters with vastly different... Oh, that was actually a good crit there. With vastly different, you know, style. And yeah, like, of course he's going to die first. Of course they're going to aim for him. It's wild. This game's wild. Massive power creep. Well, let's go... One, two, three... Why not? Okay. I could actually make it so they don't attack him. Let's do that. Uh, well, first I'll pop this. Actually, well, I don't super care. Well, no, he's just going to transform, right? So who kind of cares? Pop that on you. Okay. And let's go... Sucky, sucky. Let's go one, two, three. Or actually, I wonder if he won't transform for the sake of this battle. To, to keep it like, you know, Jekyll versus Hyde. Nope. He's gonna do it. Oh, I forgot he has a full heal, actually. He's, you know what, I'll say this. He's a good opponent. Like, he's a cool one to fight, right? Not so much as a character to play as, but his mechanics work better as an opponent. Okay. Ooh, yeah, wow, actually, dang. No, wow, okay. Okay. Should be enough for a full Odysseus combo there. Yeah, so let's go... One, two, three. Okay. Goodbye, that's fine. Thank you for the meter. Okay, this is actually surprisingly, like, I'm not going to say hard, but it's actually, like, he's putting up a fight. Right? Like, like, this is not one that I thought would, I thought this would just be, oh yeah, go in and do it. But no, my, my, man's, a, my man's a boss fight. Of course, we are 
once again, way more powerful than, you know, players would be normally here, so. Big Squishy is just the way to go. Come on, big crit. Nice. Good stuff. All right. Nice, nice. Another hundred. You know what that means? Another hunky chunk of Saint Quartz. Everyone counts. And we're going to get it so many from the, uh, the anniversary. I'm so excited. <sighs> yeah, combat power is quite as as quite good as I expected. That is massacre of the English language. Well done. Well, I'll be going now. I'm sure he learned what his limit was after all. Nothing will do you good. To, nothing will do you good to be overcome by Hyde. Don't forget your original purpose, myself. Are you going to live a life that would shame Tatsumi? Once again, a character that I don't know. Think a little, and you'd have to figure that out. Mash, Tanner, give my regards to Saber and Fran if you see them. Goodbye. Sir Fincecla's gone. We got the results of the observation. It shows that his existence itself was unstable. The demonic fog remaining in London is not perfect either, so it wasn't a proper summoner materialization. He would have disappeared by himself sometime soon anyway. So, um... <sighs> oh, <clears throat> that killed the mood. I should probably leave it at that, too. That part of me looked happy when he disappeared. What the hell was that learning his limit? Oh, my. Oh. Senpai, compared to before, he seems... Calm down? Yes. I'll return to Kaldia. Pardon me for getting you in trouble, Master. It's true I acknowledge that I am also a Hyde, but... Why is there a period there? But it wouldn't do any good if my thoughts became too hasty. It will uh, never allow me to achieve anything. Someday I will resume my battles to control Hyde myself. I'm truly sorry, Master, Mesh. I should take no more detour and start correcting the world now. I'll challenge myself to a rematch afterwards. That whole thing was... Not that that felt like that was like a final localization of the week and they were all asleep, right? So Buster card goes up even more. OK. Uh, Jekyll, intelligent, the original personality, despite peaceful, he's strong sense of justice, hide person without morals, who kills for fun and anti-hero. It's unknown whether the evil lurked within his heart or the lack of evil within him stopped the creation of something more sinister. A game of sin, an elixir that morphs him. When his hide, he acquires close-range combat abilities comparable to three knights. Perhaps because of his manifestation as assassin, or perhaps due to the loss of his master during a previous summoning. Interesting. Jekyll cannot completely suppress hide. Interesting. However, this too shall probably be settled one day. The conclusion of the conflict between good and evil is... Uh, da, 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 da. Okay, neat, 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 neat. Again, a lot of this is coming down to... I should probably get around to... I'm not going fishing. Oh, of course he did. The idea that Emya was like, you guys all need to fish is so funny. I really like that. Uh, yeah, I should probably get around to reading or listening to prototype fragments of Sky Silver sometime. Um, yeah, thank you guys for watching. We'll see you next time for, I don't know. Either some more uh, interludes, or it'll be some more, um, or it'll be the anniversary. We'll have to see. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you then. Ciao.